All right, so today is December 15th. And uh, as I said before, my last uh, day at work is the 31st. In the meantime, I got to go on the last trip with the company. Um, we went uh, about 400 miles away to Hewlett, Wyoming. Beautiful, beautiful area, as it's going to be seen from the footage. Right now, we've done a day of driving. Uh, done the business for the company and uh, recording this in the hotel but uh, Hewlett Wyoming there is uh, a, about li literally nine miles away from here there is um, I think it's a national monument uh, the Devil's Tower very interesting place uh, really different from our area we have our own uh, especially in the mountains, I guess that's probably uh, the most beautiful area in, in, in where we live, where you usually go, but uh, a really interesting place out here. So we, we were driving and men, me and Mitch were wondering how in the world that thing has formed. And uh, of course, there's probably a natural uh, explanation that could be uh, valid, maybe not, whatever. Obviously, uh, um, we uh, don't subscribe to millions of years, uh, sand and wind and whatnot. Um, so, so we were just going back and forth, uh, posing different uh, theories uh, from our, uh, just from our perspective. Uh, but at the end of the day, we decided God has decreed where that is uh, that that tower to be there. Nevertheless, a really beautiful place. Other than that, we also, uh, Mitch came, uh, came with me on a trip because we wanted to do the shakedown before the expedition for all the equipment that we have acquired, um, the video and a video and then photographic equipment and all that stuff. And uh, it really, really, we found it was, um, so it, was a, it was a smart thing to do because uh, the equipment that we have acquired, obviously we've been filming for a while, um, but uh, even the, the tripods, yeah, simple things like that, seems to be pretty straightforward, but the little nuances, how to adjust this, how to adjust that, when you don't have a muscle memory, it takes a little bit while. But anyway, so um, day of driving, we haven't uh, filmed film, uh, even the majority of the trip because mostly it's uh, it's typical Wyoming, rolling hills, sagebrush, um, uh, very, I wouldn't say monotonous, I guess it all depends on uh, um, different people have different taste as far as what's calling beauty. Uh, to my eye, ever since I came to Wyoming, it, it's, it's all beautiful. Some people don't have the same kind of appreciation for it. But uh, around here, around Hewlett, it's really, really, um, really different. All the rock formations, uh, a little bit more trees comparing to our area. The only place where we have uh, trees in our area is in the, is in the mountains. So it's, uh, it's a little bit different to our eye, and it looks uh, very nice. And uh, we're going we're gonna to miss this place. Indeed. Indeed. And of course, besides uh, um, the beauty of Wyoming, we'll be uh, leaving all the friends that we have made over the years, and that's going to be missed a great deal. Um, especially Mitch, you, you practically uh, grew up in Wyoming. Yeah. How how old were you when we came to Wyoming? Eight. Eight? Yeah, so most of most of your life basically. Mm-hmm. Yeah. All my friends are here. Which reminds <laughs> me, I forgot to tell Jacob that I came to Del um heal it. So kind of a surprise for him. Just yeah. kind of chatting back and forth. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Mitch showed me the the face, uh Unfortunately, he, he, he wasn't available to save it, but uh, I, I guess what, you, uh, you, you sent a picture of the Dallas Tower? <laughs> mm -hmm. 
and uh, Jake uh, sent a really interesting face back. What? <laughs> Anyway, until uh, so basically tomorrow uh, we'll be heading back. Uh, we're expecting a pretty uh, strong uh, snowstorm. At least that's what the weatherman is forecasting. Uh, Say so it's going to be interesting ride home, and that's about it. Um, I don't know. I guess we'll record something tomorrow. Uh, it, I don't know if we'll be able if, if anything is going to be seen because uh, they. Uh, promising eight hour uh, eight inches of snow and it's going to be uh, windy so most likely it's going to be a wipeout alrighty